Welcome back to my channel. So today's video is from Yes Girl Hair Baby. Yes Girl. They sent me this unit to review. They sent all these goodies inside. I got a wig cap, um, a bunch of wig tools. Um, that includes an elastic band. They sent me an edge brush with the rat tail comb. I love this one, okay? Then they sent this cute elastic band. I've never seen a cheetah print one before. And um, it's my new favorite. So. So I'm showing you guys the unit, you guys. This is their Bob wig. It comes already styled, already plugged, everything like is good to go. This one is throw on and go. So that's what y'all see me doing. I'm throwing this bad boy on and I'm going. <laughs> so I do want to note that I the knots don't come bleached on this, but I did for I did bleach the hairline, just the hairline part. I didn't bleach the whole wig. Um, but yeah, that, I'm just throwing that out there. But as you guys can see, it comes already ready to go. It's cut. It's 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 cut, it's flat iron, it's plucked, it's it's parted, like it's it's good to go. Just throw this on and go, okay? Um, so I'm gonna show you guys how I installed this unit, y'all. So um, it comes with a lot of lace, so I just go ahead and cut that off. Um, and then from there, I went ahead and made three incisions so that I can begin the installation process. You guys know I do a middle section and then the two sides. Um, so for today's install, I'm using the Ebon Lace Bond. This is the black bottle, my favorite, love it. So I like to spray it underneath um, first. So I'm doing that, that middle section, getting it nice and tacky. And then you go ahead and lay it directly in there um, where it needs to go. And um, you lay the hairline directly in that um, line of hairspray that you just sprayed. And then I go ahead and with a, uh, with a comb, I just kind of like comb the product into the lace to kind of get it to further melt and so that we so that our wig don't be sliding you know what i'm saying so go ahead and melt it even more with some cool air um apply that cool air like everywhere it needs to go and like you get to go like i said i do i do work in sections so i finished this section now i'm on to the other sides um again spraying that hairspray underneath the hairline and then applying that cool air and um as y'all can see the hairline is really natural on this and really pre-plucked I didn't do I didn't pluck this one at all you guys so um, yeah this this is one of the selling points on this unit that you don't have to wear baby hairs with this one I love it okay so I'm further melting it um, so now that that's done I did go ahead and spray some um, some of the hairspray on top this just adds a second layer of protection you guys are always asking me how I can get how you can get your lace to um, not slide using spray and not glue the key is layers okay get the layers in there like i said i try not to do too much on the top because it gets crispy um but yeah do that then i went ahead and applied the elastic band for a further melt left it on for about five to ten minutes or so and this is the end result y'all like laid melted like are y'all seeing that good lord <laughs> um so so um this is how i'll cut the lace i kind of like uh stick my nail up in there and then I get this razor comb and I just kind of you place it on the hairline and then you lift up and it, it makes a jagged cut and it makes the cut exactly where you want it to be like this is the only way I cut my lace now and the only way you should cut your lace now like because like it's just effortless and it makes sure that like you don't like by doing it this way it makes sure that like the lace isn't lifting after you cut it because usually when I use scissors I have to go back in and then like lay like the little parts down but y'all this was like so simple um so it will leave so the hair will leave like a little bit of a white cast but we're gonna go ahead and fix that I promise okay so to fix the white cast I just use um I, I do use the got to be glued in the yellow bottle um, I just spray a little bit on my finger and then I just kind of tap it where it needs to go. Um, make sure you, you know, placing it where it needs to go. Otherwise you will need to wipe it off, which is fine. I'll put the band back on because you want it to be melted. Okay. And once I take that off, like I said, sometimes it may leave a little bit of a, 
residue on it but just get you some little alcohol or water and kind of um you know clean that white area up that's what you guys see me doing here um, making sure that you don't see any of that um, hairspray residue because that'll that's a dead giveaway that this is a wig okay um, now I'm going in and I'm tinting the lace I'm using my contour shade which is a shade darker than like my foundation I'm using the black radiance contour palette and I'm just putting it you know it's I'm just putting it right there y'all see it's like dissolving that white cast like it's gone you guys, this wig is blending into my head, my skin, like all that. Like it's, it's just, it's giving. Now for the part, I did go in with a lighter color. This is like the color of me, like my foundation shade. This is also in the contour palette, um, but I usually use a lighter color in the part because you want it to stand out and be defined. Um, but yeah, this is, that's pretty much it, you guys. Um, so I did go ahead and kind of um, flat iron just, um, just make sure that the, the, the wig was bumped just a little bit more. Um, it kind of dented a little bit in the shipping. So um, that's what you guys see me doing. Just being a perfectionist and getting that bang how I want it to be. And you guys, like this is super cute, okay? Like the hair comes already cut and it's cut like flawless there's a lot of body to this unit you guys so that pretty much wraps it up for this review okay like this unit was super easy to install and it looks so good and so natural okay um i didn't have to do no baby hairs on this and also you can wear this glueless if you need to because it comes with an elastic band but you guys make sure y'all check this one out i'm really feeling this let me know what you think down in the comments and as always thanks for watching bye